In this video, we're going to learn a new vocabulary word. The word is conjugates. When we multiply by a conjugate, it's like multiplying two binomials together that are identical, except for the sign of the second term. If you recall, a plus b times a minus b will cause you to get a squared minus b squared. Remember that a squared minus b squared is the first term and the last term with the outer and the inner two terms adding to zero. Always be sure your final answer is simplified. In example one, we're going to use the whole concept of multiplying by conjugates and recalling that the two middle terms will div or add to zero simply because we have identical binomials except for the fact that the last terms are opposites of each other. One's positive and one's negative. Because of this, we can square the first terms or multiply those first terms together to get 16. And we can multiply the last two terms in our binomial to get the last term squared. So we're going to have negative 4 root 49. Because of this, we get 16 minus 4 times the square root of 7 squared. Remember that whole thing about multiplying or squaring the square root. It undoes that square root and you get 16 minus 4 times 7. 16 minus 4 times 7 is the same as 16 minus 28. 16 minus 28 is negative 12. This sure looks simpler than what we started with. It's always important to notice the patterns so that your whole process of multiplication becomes much simpler. In example two, we notice once again that the second term in each binomial is identical except for the sign. Because of this, we'll just multiply the first and the last terms in our binomial together to get the pieces, and then we'll simplify. 2 root 3 times 2 root 3 is 4 root 9. And negative root 6 times positive root 6 is negative root 36. If we look at the square root of 9, we know that 9 is a perfect square of 3. So we have 4 times 3 minus root 36. We know that 36 is a perfect square of 6, and so we have 4 times 3 minus 6. 4 times 3 is 12 minus 6 gives us a final answer of positive 6. Once again, that is a much nicer solution than what we started with. We've simplified this example to much, much further.